Hi everybody, this is Cyril Gupta, your friend in internet marketing and in this video I will show you List Janitor, an all new desktop application that will help you manage and clean your email lists. You can import your email lists in the form of a text file or a CSV file. So let's get started by importing a list into List Janitor. So let's click on the import button right over here and that's going to show us a dialog we can select a text file or if you've got a csv file with email list and other information you can click on the csv file let's go for the text file for now click on the text file and the list is added to list janitor to see the contents of the list we will just click on it and we can see all the email addresses in the list now we will get started with the functions and how list janitor can actually make it very easy for you to clean or manage your list first i'm going to show you how to clean your list using list janitor to get started first you need to set up what level of cleaning do you want so here's the email cleaning options click on it and you will see a dialog box with the different options that you have to clean your emails and here are the options. The first thing, you can remove the duplicates. So if there are any duplicates in your email list, it will be removed. You can remove role and spam addresses. Now, this is something that all other responders need. If you are sending emails to email addresses like support at your domain.com or sales at your domain.com or mails like that, then autoresponders will not accept your list because these are called role addresses and autoresponders do not support role addresses anymore. They like to have clean lists which do not have the role addresses. So you can remove the role addresses too. Then third, we've got spam traps. Now, if you are offering something for download when people sign up, many people will use temporary email lists temporary email addresses which will disappear after a little while they will take your download and they will still not be on your list you want to remove such people because if those addresses are on your list then the mails will not be delivered and the mail quality will be very low the delivery rate will be very low and also autoresponders again autoresponders and SNTP companies they do not support spam traps on your email list so if you're trying to import an email list with spam traps in it they will be rejected next we've got invalid emails so if for some reason your your opt-in system is not double opt-in maybe it's single opt-in system or maybe you're not verifying the emails uh, which are being fed by your customers then you might have invalid email addresses in your list and you can remove those by checking this option next we've got verified domains and this is a very advanced feature using this feature list janitor will actually go and talk to each domain that the list has and verify that there is a valid mail server behind that domain which means that if there is an email uh, address in action or is there an email address that's active then this is the first level of verifying that there is actually an email address that exists on the domain on the domain then finally we have verify each email address separately using smtp which means that list janitor will actually go and pretend to send an email to the server in question and if the server uh, says yes if the server says yes this recipient exists then list janitor knows that this is a real valid email address so that way you can actually 100 percent verify that the email address exists and that there is it's not an invalid or a fake email id so with these options turned on with all these options turned on list janitor is going to give you a very clean list that you can safely mail and even import in autoresponders or send out an email using smtps like sendgrid without getting banned for having low quality lists to actually clean the list all you need to do is click on this play button and list janitor will start cleaning your list it's going to show you the overall progress and it's going to show you as it cleans the individual list so we've got all the options you know started we've got all the options running and now list janitor is actually cleaning the list as we go it's verifying each and every email right now it's verifying the domains for each email and finally when it's done you will get a complete report of which addresses were validated and which addresses were rejected 
you can save this list the filtered list using the tool over here export verify to csv or to text export rejected whatever you want so this is how the cleaning function works but list janitor goes beyond that and now let's take a look at some of the other features of list janitor in tools you can merge lists which means you can merge two lists together let's just import two lists and here we got two lists and if you wanted to merge them you can click on one then click on the second then click on merge lists and give it a new name like my compound list and just click on add and it's going to create a new list with all the addresses in the two lists in this case first list is a sub list of the second one so uh, the total is the same but in your case if you merge it you will get a list with both the email addresses in both the list together of course without any duplicates then the second feature you have is subtract list so if i was to subtract two lists maybe the second list from the first list and i click on subtract list i will get a third list without the addresses in the first list so that's subtract list for you then i've got another feature find common addresses which can find you the common addresses in two lists and then you can also find the unique addresses which are not in the second list so this is how the merge list feature works then you got domain stats which will give you an analysis of each domain and the people who are a part of the list from that domain you can actually look at how many people have signed up from each domain and you can have a look at this little graph which will show you visually how many people have signed up from each domain but that's not all you can even create sublist by count so if i wanted to maybe uh, create a sublist from the first to the tenth element in this list i could just click on add and i would have a list with those many people you can create sublist for domain you can create sublist using just the duplicates people who are duplicates in that list you can create a sublist by date so if you got a csv file imported with the sign up date in the csv file you can actually shortlist for the number of people who signed up on a particular date and finally you can even shortlist for a column value so using this system you may be in the csv file you had the sign up country then you can create a sublist using uh, the sign up country itself which actually lets you target people according to the demographics so list janitor is a complete package a complete list management and list cleaning software you've definitely seen nothing like this as comprehensive as this earlier and it's a must-have tool for you in your email marketing toolbox